Drivers who cross over 435 along Rowe Avenue in Johnson County may want to find a new route to take home tonight. Mitch Weber is live along 435, the busy intersection, to explain what's going on there, Mitch. Yeah, hey, Cynthia. Yeah, the road bridge, it is coming down. Let me get out of the way. Uh, and uh, KDOT tells me these structures started showing their age a couple years ago. The bridge, close, bridge closure will last until October. Now, lane closures, though, started today. Then tomorrow, east and westbound I-435 off ramps to Row Avenue will close. The estimated cost for this interchange project is almost $9.5 million. KDOT says they're saving 10 percent of that cost by bringing the bridge down all at once and diverting traffic. They understand the headache it will cause drivers until October. The Row Avenue drivers are probably going to see, you know, are definitely going to have the greatest impact um, just not being able to get over I-435. There will be, um, you know, random daily lane closures either at ramps or on 435 as needed. Of course, uh, you can see that there's still traffic going over the row, uh, row bridge, but of course that will change in the next couple of days. Now they're going to take down this bridge overnight, both Friday and Saturday. So between row and Knoll here on 435, it will close during the overnight hours, Friday and Saturday. All that information is on our website, KSHB.com. Reporting live at Overland Park, Mitch Weber, 41 Action News.